Okay, ready? Okay, I'm gonna give you a tour of the future studio. Still lots of work to be done, but come on in. It's done. It's done. It's done. It's done. It's done. I can't believe it. It's been two years. Two years when this place, when we first came in here, it was cold, it was dark, no running water, no heat, no electricity, no plumbing, nothing. Just a shell. We had to do a lot of demo. My brother-in-law, Joe, did so much work while I was doing the art shows. Of course, this year with no art shows, allowed me to do a lot of painting and sanding, polyurethaning, and it's just been a crazy, super busy time. Busiest, hardest time I've ever worked for a consistent period of time. But in the end, I am so happy and grateful to this is a place where I get to showcase my art in different color combinations in a place that's not like the shows where I have to run around in different, you know, different places, temporary installations. Uh, I did miss the shows this year, not seeing everybody, not seeing you, and just meeting people and getting ideas and just, um, the, the thrill of it. But now we have a gallery here. You could come anytime. Well, I'll tell you my hours there. Um, and you can always find me online. But um, so proud. We used a lot of local uh, crafters and artists to build this place. Uh, wood from the Wood Mill of Maine and NC Hunt, local mills. Did a beautiful job with these floors. I pol I sanded all of them, polyed all of them. Of course, I had a lot of help. Learned so much. Aaron and I learned so much in the process. It's very expensive, by the way, too, to renovate two old buildings. But I think in the end, we're gonna be part of the community and um, I look forward to focusing and creating more art and having a place to call my own I still got another thing I have to do. I have to do the hallway here. So that's not completely done. But come and visit, come and check it out. Okay, so you ready for a tour? Here we go. So the first time I painted this, I changed colors twice. I finally settled for iron ore. In fact, this place 150 years ago was an iron ore dealer. They sold iron ore here. And this paint is called iron ore. So it makes total sense to use this color. I love it. Uh, it also reminded me of an old pub in England that was using that. It's like 200, 400 year old pub or something. So they use that color. Are you ready? Let's go inside the gallery. Okay. Well, as you can see, this is the part where I need to, <laughs> I need to finish up this hallway here. But this is a hallway down to the garage in which I'll be doing some more work down there too as well. And the Lighthouse series, since this is the very beginning piece of work that I did for the main Lighthouse collection, it took me two and a half years through the first six. That was 2007. And so uh, this was the beginning of my business of creating art of main Lighthouses. I love the space I have here to display the art in a prominent manner. The color combinations, that's the tricky part, getting the right combinations for the prints. But I like the way this flows here. My canvas series is what I'm really looking forward to working on. I have the space now to do it. And these are more special limited edition pieces. And I look forward to making these huge ones and different sizes. And this is where we put together the framed art. We have a laminator right over there that protects the art and this is my library of art already laminated. This is where I keep a lot of my prints in here and this is where we cut the papers and assemble everything. And uh, it's 
So we're still getting all the things together to uh, make this more efficient, but it's much more space and much nicer. So when you do the shows, the art shows, it's uh, it's pretty hectic, and you're running around a lot, and uh, I don't always feel like I'm doing a good job putting things together. But here I had a chance to just to you know to make it look like it's in a home, and um, so that you really get a feel of what. It could look like in your home. By the way, don't forget about AR, augmented reality. It's on your cell phone. You could just use a cell phone right now. Go to my website and you could actually place the artwork framed on your walls and see what it would look like in, in a virtual reality. It's a really neat thing. There's no app required either and there's no email sign up. So check it out. And if you're wondering, and if you're wondering if we offer any curbside pickup, well, worry no more. Yes, we do. So if you don't feel like coming in, no problem. Just order online, send us an email, and uh, we could. Um, uh, we, we take precautions, wear masks, and uh, try to do the right thing to keep, uh, keep us all safe. So I hope you come up or come down to Gardner, Maine. It's a great little town, you know, there's like a great burrito place. You still legit burritos, barn boards and more. That's a great store. I bought this table from them. Really cool stuff, antique, vintage stuff. Okay, so I hope you come down and see us and I'll be happy to sign the prints and sign your calendars, personalize them. If I'm here in the studio, which I'm always here most of the time anyway. So thank you so much and we'll see you again soon.